What's happening, people? We're back here once again on Cub Cam TV for this another edition of Cub Reacts. I'm super excited to be back inside the building. As per, this one dropped a couple of hours ago and I had to update a few things on my OBS. And finally, we are ready to record. Uh, we've got another light set up now as well, so hopefully the picture is even more clear than it was before. Um, out to each and every one of you supporting the channel, of course. If you aren't already subscribed, please do make sure you are hitting that subscribe button at the bottom of the page, turning notifications on, and just getting involved in general. We're aiming for 5,000 subs by the end of next week so next friday because next friday is my birthday and it'd be an amazing birthday present if i can hit that 5,000 subs mark by then so uh we're going to get to this one today from rima i hope i'm pronouncing that correctly this is the first time i've actually uh, reviewed anything from him i'm looking forward to getting into it uh the sound the tune's called woman as well um the the artist that was was heavily requested on the channel so i thought you know what i'll dive into this one and uh yeah i'm looking forward to getting into it but one thing to remember guys there will be a lot of pauses and um cuts in this video primarily because youtube has gone, become absolutely crazy for copyright right about now so we need to make sure we are adhering to their guidelines as well as that we use these opportunities to really break down the tune break it down musically break down the production the vocal performance the lyricism and the music video itself so if that's not your cup of tea feel free to watch a different one however we're going to get into this one right about now and i hope you do enjoy it so let's go <laughs> This already sounds super, super interesting. Just off the introduction, those sort of really side-chained, um, kind of bouncing vocals, kind of layered next to those kick drums, all in a sort of lo-fi intro. Really interesting way to start off this tune. As I said, this is the first time I've re reviewed something from Rima. I'm hoping, um, I'm hoping I'm going to enjoy it. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure I will. Though. It's been requested so many times, so I'm assuming I will. <laughs> Another banger. I'm in love with plenty women. I know mm. my Maria, all of them. You know my daddy shape of color. I go make sure say I'm on. You know what? I'm immediately getting vibes off. Um, there was a tune that got released by Burner Boy last year called Anybody. Um, that for me was tune of the year last year. The way the shakers roll combined with the drums on this one, and I think um Rima's vocal tones to begin with, um, the sort of melodies he's using immediately remind me of that tune, which is really, really cool to see. The video looks like very high budget. There's a lot of drama going on. You've got loads of flowers in the corner. Um, this looks like almost like a backstage room at a theater or like a concert. Um, I'm liking it so far. Again, quite stripped back, but still very rhythmic. To be mm. You know what? Everything about this literally fits right into the sort of little pocket of sound that I absolutely adore. The rhythm's fantastic. There's so much going on. It's all, obviously, it's a very kind of Afrobeats influenced tune. There's so much percussive flavor in there. So many little elements that are all adding to the overall rhythmic flavor. We've already got a one on one dance scene in the music video, which I love to see. Um, and just in general, the whole vibe of the tune is really nice. I'm really liking Rima's vocal tones, the patterns he's using, the melodies he's bringing. Um, there's almost like quite an uplifting feel to everything it sounds to an extent um it, it just it, it just has a good vibe about it you know it's got good energy and i'm really liking it this is super super catchy i'm loving the hook i'm assuming this is because the, the tune's called woman um again really catchy vocal lines really nice interweaving of flows with the um with the rhythm that's taking place like very stripped back there's not much melody going on occasionally we're getting a bit of a horn appearing every now and then but bar that in general it's, it's very stripped back and it's all about the vocal the drums and the the rhythm that kind of falls between the two and he's he's doing a really good job of it i feel like woman i do like woman <laughs> Uh, I've got to say, the video is looking fire as well. Like the, the lighting on everything, the, there's like four or five different scenes going on, loads of different costume changes as well. The whole vibe of the video looks really, really good. It's definitely a, a higher budget video um, and it's shot really nicely. I think it assists the tune quite well. There's a lot of dancing going on. There's a lot of, um, uh, just in general, there's just, there's a lot going on and not a lot going on at the same time, which is really cool. I feel almost to an extent, the amount that's going on in the music video kind of fills out what isn't happening in the tune which is quite often the case to be honest with you <laughs> instrumental wise right about now we're starting to hear those chords come into play those very kind of classic um 
Afrobeat chords that we do here quite regularly. The, the sort of organ lines are slowly pressuring into the mix and they're sounding really, really smooth. They're adding depth to the overall composition. We're getting the um, we're get we're getting we're getting the vocals in the background, um, the sort of chorus lines in the background as well. Really, really nice combination of different factors, and it, it's just it's just sitting really nicely on the ears. <laughs> Mm, everything about that the, the kind of way the tune completely stripped back um amazing really really like that the the the, the drum patterns the, the percussion the way everything just kind of leveled out and then hit those sort of that sort of three tom roll bang into the breakdown and now it looks like we've got a big room dancing which i absolutely love let's go really really nice the key change is, is is wicked it almost kind of dips into the arabic scale there to an extent the vocal patterns he's using the sort of vocal influxes the sort of ups and downs um of the vocal line this seems really really nice almost like a portable studio that's been set up and then obviously we've got the the sort of dancing going on all in unison as well really suits this type of tune um overall this is wicked <laughs> I'm loving about this tune is it's constantly changing there's new elements happening all the time we've had the key change we've had the big bridge we've had changes in rhythm we've had changes in vocal lines and now we've got this one again a different uh, kind of section of the tune it's almost like a second bridge with no immediate kind of high-end drums going on it's all low-end and all lo-fied out and filtered down really really smooth <laughs> Can you hear this and not smile bro this just has summer written all over it the the the, the kind of color that's in that percussion the the kind of high end of it it's so bright and it, it, it just puts you into a good mood how i don't understand how percussion can be uplifting but it is you know it's, it's amazing the way it's been put together again looking like we're moving into another scene there's been so many people in the music video um again it's just constantly shifting constantly changing keeping your attention which is quite difficult to do in an era where everyone is a musician and everyone's uploading you know so doing a really good job of this one. In the background there as well, we're hearing that sort of eh, le, 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 le. another kind of female vocal line, which is adding into the mix as well. A whole new element, which I hadn't picked out before. But again, it's something else being thrown in. It's almost like a, it's almost like every, it's like opening an advent calendar. You know, there's something new in every single, every single pocket we move into every day. There's a new bit, every section, there's a new one. It's crazy, man. Like on a production level, this is a phenomenal piece of work. I do like woman. say that's a large apple <laughs> i eat an apple every day at work this I've, i never have apples that big maybe that's just me maybe i come from somewhere where there aren't nice apples who knows I mean, you know me, if you follow this channel, you know I love sort of synchronized dance routines in the big room with the lighting and everything. It looks epic, been really well shot. Um, just the moves in general look really, really cool. The whole layout of the tune, we've now got big sort of orchestral drums kind of coming in with those doom, doom, those big sounds. It's this, this layer here is very much just percussion and, and low end, and it's still got just as much rhythm as the rest of the tune. Brilliant. <laughs> Again, a whole nother new section. This is bridge number three, people. Bridge number three. I don't understand how people are able to get this much into a tune and it's still sound cohesive. On a production level and on a compositional level, this is A star, A star. I think I think the video has done a very good job, to be honest with you. Bridge at the end here is again really really nice it's just the constant progression and i've said that there's a lot going on a lot of times but i'm so surprised at how much is getting kind of pushed into this tune the whole layout of the tune is beautiful there's so many attractive people in the video let's be real um lots of people smiling lots of people just enjoying the video shoot by the looks of things as well it's a good vibe the tune's got good energy what more can you want at the end of the day and there we go i just want to relax i'm thinking I really like the video. Really well shot. I'm pretty sure we are now approaching the outro, so we're just going to let this run, and then we'll get into our breakdown of the tune. Hopefully you enjoy. 
There we go. Um, out to everyone who has enjoyed this breakdown. I really enjoyed this tune. I've got to say, first time listening to Rima properly. Um, I really liked this tune. I liked the music video. I liked the elements. The thing about this that stands out for me the most is the progression. There's this weird kind of rumor that within, that, like the, the only genre that's allowed to be progressive is, is progressive house music, which is really, really dumb. Tunes like this, tunes like jazz, that, like progression comes from jazz primarily. Um, and, and when we see that idea of tunes constantly growing and evolving and changing and all these different elements being thrown in there and it's over a tune like this it's amazing to hear and i think rima does an amazing an amazing job um of doing the vocal lines constantly almost assisting the instrumental as it goes but working very much in unison with it uh, subject matter on this one really really good basically saying how much he loves women which is amazing to hear the whole let that there's so many like beautiful people in the video as well really nicely shot uh, the dance scenes for me always do bits so there we go um i hope you have enjoyed this one people if you have enjoyed please do make sure you are hitting that subscribe button at the bottom of the page. Uh, that's it from me, and we'll see you all next time. Peace.